All right, we are back, everybody. Pinewood Prep School launching their new Leadership Institute for the 2014-2015 school year. Their goal to equip each student with a collection of skills and abilities that will help them become the leaders of tomorrow. Steve Mandel and Olivia Coyle join us right now with more on the Leadership Institute up at Pinewood. So, Steve, welcome to the program. Great to have you here. Great to see you as well. And the school year kicks off next week, you said, and kind of a new option for kids that might uh, impart some very valuable life lessons. Absolutely. We're excited about the new institute, John. It's, it's really based on some fairly simple ideas. One is that the world's going to need great leaders, particularly the world that these young people are going to move into. Secondly, it makes the very safe assumption that this generation is really poised for leadership. Yeah. They volunteer, they serve, they've been active their whole careers, their whole educational careers. So we, we've tried to do is pull together a very deliberate program for all of our high school students. It's actually for every single Pinewood High School student to participate in a few very key ways and what's the new leadership. Yeah, tell us about those seven ways, those kind of uh, hallmark things that these kids need to know to be successful. Well, some of the things they're really working on is a sense of personal mastery, you know, understanding how to achieve and how to be good at something, um, but also very importantly focused on communication, inspiring and motivating others, um, being a responsible citizen. At Pinewood, we talk about leadership in one very important frame, which is the notion of how can I help? How can I be of service? And we think that's sort of at the at the cornerstone of the Leadership Institute itself. Absolutely. Uh, Olivia, you took leadership at Pinewood. So yes, tell me about uh, that class a little bit and, and what it really meant to you and how you're using those lessons in your everyday life right now. Um, we learned a lot of different skills. Like you have to think positive all the time. And she gave us different like scenarios, like moral, ethical scenarios. And you have to say, like, what would a leader do in this situation? Um, I've been able to use it. I've worked on my public speaking skills, so mm -hmm. that was good. We, um, we planned an assembly. They did like a class light assembly, so that was really cool too. We got an opportunity to do like leadership stuff like that in front of the whole high school. Yeah. Do you think that uh, you know, even with your friends, with your parents in your everyday life that you are, are more of a leader after taking this class? And do you think that you're being more assertive? Uh, definitely. We learned the difference between like assertive and passive and you should always be assertive. And uh, I learned how to like work in a group and how to motivate others. Okay. And Steve, you must you see these kids before they take the class and then after. Uh, what's it like? What's that transformation like? Well, it was interesting. Where I think one of the best examples, Olivia touched on this notion of the school wide assembly um, that was organized by the leadership group. And I think it was interesting to see not only how they rose with their individual skills, but how they learned to work together, take on different roles within a structure of planning an event. Um, so just even in the short term, we saw the benefits of that course, which is why we've added five or six other courses to this array called the Leadership Institute. If students are out there watching right now or, or families of Pinewood Prep students, uh, how can they learn more about the program and what do they need to do to sign up? It's real simple. I mean, for those students that are part of the school, it's been part of their scheduling as we move forward. For interested people interested in Pinewood, they can either contact our admissions office or Babette Hamilton, our high school principal, who really is the person that developed this notion of Leadership Institute well, sort of like at the core of the program. Indeed, a wonderful program. And as part of their graduation requirement, every student is going to have to participate in this, mm -hmm. correct? That's correct. They have to take a, a certain amount of courses that run the gamut from leadership studies, um, 21st century communication, ethics, civics and service learning, et cetera, et cetera. They also have to complete an internship of 30 hours before they graduate from Pinewood as well as get involved with service work in their communities. Uh, we have a great school trip program every fall. They get involved with that as well. So these are the various components that all tie together to be really what's the leadership. Yeah, why did you want your students to, to take on, especially that, that service project out in the community? Yeah, we just felt that, you know, part of it was looking around Pinewood and, and figuring out what had always been a strength of the school, which is giving back. And so we felt like we had many, many examples of kids who've not only served but created service projects from the ground up. And so we felt that that was important criteria for someone who was a leader was yeah. to really understand how to give back and how to organize giving back. Absolutely. And that's something that's at your core too, right? Giving back? Yes, sir. Well, keep it going this year. If people want to learn more, they have a website they can go to? They go right to the Pinewood website. There's a page for Leadership Institute. Very, very cool. Or check out their Facebook page for much more information. Guys, thank you so much for being here and best thank of luck you. this thank school year. Thank you for having us. Thank you. Thank All you. right. Now, over to my friend Tom Crawford. Well, most Americans will live longer than they had imagined, and a healthy 65-year-old can reasonably expect to live for an additional 20